guys, so what's up, y'all? Flying back though today. Got a really, 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 really quick um, Dragon Ball Legends video. I want to do that really quick. And Delkin, of course. I mean, Delkin, then Legends. So we got some really good news. We had the new VGM links that are out, stuff like that. Um, little video, I won't get out to it or whatever. Just had to redo it. A lot of just stuff going on. Um, today, specifically for me, I don't know what's going on, but yeah. Um, we did get some really good news. We have a new Super Saiyan 4 God Dina officially coming to Dokken for JP and stuff like that. I will probably know what he does like next, like, you know, the end of the month or whatever. I mean, because I tend to do it probably like after Halloween, maybe November, because I mean, no, it's the end of November, we're gonna get a Dokken Fest before the year ends. We always got no, not, not December. I'm thinking, I'm getting way off track. Because November, that's when Global's got the 50 celebration, Tanabata, and I know for, um, um, December and then the year we're gonna get a new Doka Fest. So yeah, um, um, just some little stuff I want to talk about and go over really quick. And we do have the official links and stuff like that, full high quality. Like I said, I would could do a video. I was gonna do a video for it. You guys promised. So yeah, um, of course we have a new Super Saiyan for Gogeta GT. Uh, says right there specifically. Um, they probably have parentheses and stuff like that in the game anyway, so it tends to do that type of thing. I feel like they could end up doing that, um, stuff like that because you know parentheses and stuff like that. But in, like Super Saiyan Four. GT Gogeta or something like that. I thought they could do that instead of Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Um, I mean, I thought they're going to end up doing that. They need to put Super Saiyan 4 GT Vegeta and go Goku eventually. Uh, so, yeah. And of course, we're getting, we're getting a new free to play card from the 55th episode of GT where basically this Vegeta going on about his life, blah blah blah, Kakarot, and that, that typical stuff. While well, for Super Saiyan 4 Goku's fighting Nova Shimron, um, Vegeta's, you know, it's just like a whole Vegeta episode, literally, literally just there for Vegeta to talk about his life. Literally, Maja Boo fight all over again where it's just, you know, writing on, you know, it's um, typical stuff for Vegeta. I'm not saying like blah blah blah, but typical Vegeta stuff. But yeah, um, again, those should be next like couple of days and stuff like that. Uh, next couple of days, um, probably end of this, probably almost say beginning of November, I want to say, because um, because you know, already know Dope is going to do something on Halloween for Gold Boy Angel because Ultimate Gohan does feel like a couple more days for Gold Boy, and I feel like the is not going to be that far behind, so. Because again, Goku did do a celebration first, and Japanese can like do it a couple of days later or whatever. Um, so yeah, I think, yeah, I was, I was almost over. That's freaking insane. And of course, for um, again, we're getting a new GT Vegeta that goes to grade 8, specifically just to grade 8, not golden grade 8, even though he, oh yeah, because he did go great for a couple of minutes, then he turned golden, then Super Saiyan 4. Um, therefore, Legends, we are getting a new meta cooler. Um, like I said, it's gonna have Supernova, and of course, we're gonna get a new um, Vegeta. Um, and it's gonna swap out with a big bang attack that swaps out to Goku, Super Saiyan Goku from the Cooler movie. Even though we already got a new one, even though he's pretty, already pretty good, they're gonna be amazing together. So I guess it's like a more like a Broly and Chile, Broly and Chilo, um, Chile, uh, Broly and Chile, or Chile. And like the great same I went to, um, Swappable Unit. Again, Doka did this a long time ago with Exchange Units, we didn't have it since like the, um, it was a unique thing, they didn't do it for like, since like, almost like the, almost like a whole, almost year-ish. Maybe like five, six, seven months. Um, okay, guys, I'm back. Um, I don't know what happened, but yeah, like I said, of course, a new. Um, I don't know what I can't remember what I said. Um, I, I left off. I don't know where I left off. Um, I was gonna say that. Um, we, I mean, of course, you know, a new Super Saiyan Four Gogeta. Um, you know, Big Bang Attack and stuff like that. Um, Big Bang Kamen Um, he's got a voice and stuff like that. Active skills, typical stuff. Um, a new GT grade, just regular grade A GT Vegeta. Um, a, tr a transforming grade Vegeta, I guess. I don't know how it's going to be structured. Again, okay, we're going to probably know when the data download hits. I really want to say, like, at the end of the month, maybe? Um, probably end of, like, November. Let's scoop a little bit. Um, probably, like, November. Actually, yeah, let me scoop a little bit. Um, highly, highly, highly November, I really want to say. Um, because I feel like they're going to um, end up sending, sending it for that. I don't feel like they're going to do nothing at, at the end of the month because we still have, we still have Halloween to go through. And I don't know how they're going to structure with that. Anyway, but again, we don't know how it's going to be structured there following. But yeah, again, we should know um, more news stuff like that as the next days go on. So again, we should you know we should know more stuff as the time goes on though. But yeah, because again, Goldman JP, their campaigns are set up to where we're going to have stuff at the same time. They do this before. Sometimes, you know, Goldman might be like a day ahead, like at the end of this month. At times recording, um, we already know at the end of the month, Gohan's full celebration campaign ends at the end of the month. But we're going to have like a part two. I think probably just missions and stuff like that. And for JP, um, they're getting you freezer and stuff like that. And well, um, we know how it's gonna be structured for them. Um, because, um, you know, we always do this stuff. Not like a part two or whatever. We get like kind of like a side thing, like with the Kepler celebration. Technically, it was two parts, but that is some more stuff in there. You know, for all our good Chris EZA, you know, the characters we have to use stuff like that. So, yeah. And of course, we already know Legends is getting, of course, a new, um, 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 Mecha Cooler, which I'm glad because the red one sucked. Like, he was good. He was dead on arrival pretty much. Yeah, even when I first leaked him and stuff like that, he was pretty okay. He wasn't like the best or whatever. But yeah. 
Um, of course, we got a new Vegeta, of course, in that movie as well. That swaps out into Goku. Again, we have had, we haven't like really, it's like Doku with the exchange units. We haven't had that for like months. And now we kind of got it now. Um, of course, the Vegeta swaps out into, um, I would say swap out and stuff like that. You know, swaps out to um, Super Saiyan Goku. I'm going to swap back and forth like a fun little side unit. I would love that, honestly. Um, of course, I thought it was someone else. I'm not okay. Yeah. Um, again, though, um, I'm trying to go. I can't remember what I said. I lost my train of thought. But yeah, um, again, it's like the you know, the cis unit and stuff like that. You know, we didn't have one for months. Now we got, you know, we got like Rex in one too. I feel like they're gonna try can't crank it out every other celebration because with these V-Jump cards, they don't come to like they don't come for like a long time. We see it like with not Trio Danger. They came up pretty fast. Um, what was the last V-Jump? Go ten trunks. It was before that. I can't remember. Somewhat before that, we yeah, did have for like months or whatever. We had a super long time, and it was just like holy crap, man. We had to just wait, wait, and wait. Yeah. Um, but yeah, though. Um, yeah, so again, the four images up right here. Um, but yeah, that was on um, pretty much like this beginning. I just want to talk about. See, these are the full quality images and stuff like that. Again, I'll look below for you guys. I always do it every video. And I would put it in the thumbnail. I always do that. But yeah, of course, on um, Miguel, I'm actually got it up. So yeah, of course, we got Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Just a regular Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Again, we're going to get a great um, you know, Vegeta that goes to great and stuff like that from the 55th episode from GT where he's ranting on and talking and nah, nah, nah. But yeah, of course, like I said, though, um, guys, I'm back once more. I don't know. If my video keeps crashing, sorry about that. It just, I don't know what's going on with it today. I have no idea. I don't know. But yeah, uh, of course, we got the full leaks for Gogeta right here and stuff like that. Of course, we got the R art and the TR and stuff like that. Like I said before, though, um, specifically, um, when they usually show up the SSR, like with um, Girl Boss Super Broly and Gogeta, we had their um, SSRs and stuff like that. Um, you know, we had like different arts for them. I think the assets came out Super Attack. Oh, we had the typing, fully and stuff like that. I think Vijay did before, but then that, that kind of stopped. I think Vijay Gohans. I know Texel and Air Gator, Easy Ace, Easy Ace, Nuts, and V Jump and stuff like that. Um, the OG has to go Super Saiyan on. Um, no, it was, um, I think it was Vijay Gohan and Texel. Oh, the Easy Ace. Um, you guys, when you guys Easy Ace, I think they show up his typing. And I think Gohan's typing. I can't remember. It's been a long time though. But yeah. Um, of course, we got the full high quality image right here. Also, we got you know, something else I really want to put. I'm in a point right here. Coming down here. Um, it kind of explains the you know, OG story event and stuff like that. It also explains down here in your keys. Right down here, I think specifically down here, it specifically says, um, I think we're getting like, I think it's down here. Oh um, no, yeah, GT Vegeta. Yeah, GT and stuff like that. SSR. Yeah, I think somewhere down here it says specifically we are getting like a Dragon Ball Heroes collab. So it's confirmed we are getting another Dragon Ball Heroes collab. Of course, November. So yeah, this guy definitely could be November, basically. A lot of people thinking it could be Super Saiyan 4 just because this guy right here. I could say yes. But I feel like they're more like, you know, it's dope defense exclusive specifically. That's what I feel it has. Um, but yeah. Um, that's why I feel it has specifically though. But um honestly though, I wouldn't mind having my Joker Fest unit so, but like our first Joker Fest heroes, because it's in ten years since the heroes came out and stuff like that. So we could see it, maybe, but with this guy releasing, that does kinda make sense if you know before a big celebration or something like that happens you know, like the Dallas celebration where we have to go on and okay I'm back again um I don't know what's going on I don't know but yeah um like I said there recently um down here said Dragon Ball Heroes campaign collab stuff like that so again we'll probably see it you know upcoming days and stuff like that um so yeah um good move on to Legends finally just oh my lord man Whew, so yeah we got the Legends scan right now because it's too many. So, more okay that's good Okay, so yeah, for Legends, of course, we're getting the medical and stuff like that, of course. I have the um, full description for the thing up here. Um, and the Super Saiyan Vegeta. Oh, uh, did, did I ever see that? Okay, that was really weird. I don't think you guys saw that. The stats. Let me see. Yeah, cooler. The cutouts. Oh, my lord. So, yeah, of course, we got Goku and Vegeta. Of course, when they're less, um, when there's less members on the battlefield, they're going to power up and stuff like that. They're going to greatly increase their power. The more powerful, um, you know, the Oscar is and stuff like that, the better the um, cover changes. And then the cover change. Then the ultimate, the ultimate um, arts card destructive combo. And Goku and Vegeta attack together. It does massive damage. Special move is big mega attack. Meta cooler and overall on um, meta cooler, you know, regen and stuff like that. Better than the red one. And of course, um, he did a lot of damage early on. He didn't do really do dam that damage early on, but super attack is our ultimate. Um, it's called metallic um, supernova, which has the less still of that sound. You know, oh yeah, some purple, you know, purple flashes and stuff like that in the background. But yeah, gonna go into the video here. Sorry, it was a little rough mess for me. It took me like almost an hour just to record this video. But yeah, we got the video blades, of course, for Gogeta, and of course, um, 
of Vegeta, of course, Gogeta right there, for Doki, and Legend Pacific, um, you know, specifically. So what do you guys think? All that cool stuff, all I get, it was beautiful, awesome, amazing. So yeah, see you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day, great. All cool junk again though. Good again into here. Oh gosh, it's crazy. So what do you guys think? Yeah, see you guys later though, again though. Peace out.